What's up, Gemini gang? Happy Friday, aka Venus Day, aka other day of love. This will be for the singles and the sing guys. All Gemini placements take what resonates, speak the rest, take it how it resonates with you and your situation. If you need a personal, check out the description of box. Hit those likes, y'all. Thank you for being here. My social medias are in the description box. I don't have any other social medias. This one again. Oh, gosh. Okay. So we have, oh, gosh, the runner. Mm -hmm. Singles. This is what we're doing. Why? Why? Why are we doing this right now? Why? Okay. It's the same energy I kind of got with, from you guys in the you versus them. So we have a poker face. Mm -hmm. This is taking a chance, risking options, not showing hand, and gambling. Then we have mirror. This is mirroring each other, self-reflection, introspection, and inner wounds. And then we have a not today. Have I ever, I don't think I've ever seen this one for you. Because I know I've only seen it a couple times. Um, boundaries and hurt, avoiding conversation, not dealing and still upset. See, again, I kind of got this from your energy in the last read. So let's see what's going on here, Gemini's, because, um, yeah, you ain't feeling it, okay? Oh, gosh. What is going on? Five of Swords. You're feeling away with someone. Why is this coming out in the singles read? I keep seeing the Ten of Swords. Why is this coming out in the singles reading, though? Like... You single, you shouldn't even be having these problems. Uh, some of you may be um, stuck on something from the past. And that's, again, that's what I got in the last uh, read, too. Two of Cups, yeah, you're mirroring someone. The Justice on the bottom. So if you are dating someone or seeing someone, then things are kind of moving off. Ooh, yikes. Now, this came out in the last read on y'all side. You versus them. Um, yeah. Yeah. Could be a, a Leo for some of you. Um, King of Wands here. You got Leo in your chart. So, oh yeah, the the runner is a fear of intimacy, running away, intensity, and letting go, turmoil, and fleeting. So, are you now the runner in a situation, Gemini's, or did a past situation turn you into a runner? It's like. Especially keep seeing that Ten of Swords. It's like you you may think worst case scenario, Gemini's, while you're dating or while you're, um, you know, while you're dealing with people because of something from the past, because of something that someone else did. Um, okay, but I, I'm seeing here there could be like um, definitely some type of twin flame situation, which I keep getting that for y'all. I got that in the last read too. Um, but there is someone here that you have a very like strong connection with or you will. So take this how it resonates with you. But you could also like feel stuck to someone, you know, someone from your past, Gemini, someone that may have hurt you in the past that might be still affecting your love life now. It's like some of you may be avoiding someone like altogether. Yeah, I'm not taking any of these, but I will show you guys what came out. Lots of cards um came out so you know uh, yeah i feel like some of you guys may not be over another situation um and that could be causing blockages in your love life even if you think you're over it you're not you're not over it okay um so this is going to involve some type of soul searching and this is what i always mean as far as you being you getting so self-aware that somebody else isn't going to be able to come in and tell you about you Okay, Queen of Cups here um, could be a Cancer. I'm seeing the Fool here, um, and a lot of times, uh, if you are attracting someone that still has a lot of past trauma and a past and past hurts, and you're also attracted to that person, then you also have some traumas and things like that that you haven't dealt with, uh, Gemini's. Even though that's hard to hear, it's easy to be like, oh, well, they run away because uh, they have so much trauma and blah, blah, blah. But you're attracted to that person. You see what I'm saying? You're not going to be attracted to someone that you're not like. OK, so, you know, I feel like some of you, you may have uh, some stuff that some inner wounds that you still need to address. And that could be why um, this is a lot of this is coming up for you. 
it is emotionally for a lot of you a lot of you don't you don't show your emotions and again yeah nine of swords some of you you may um you hold yourself back from really like loving um and being loved gemini because of something that happened in the past for you now i was gonna say this could be someone in your energy but the likelihood of that is very slim it's it's, it's either you or it's both of you Gemini's because this car literally says mirroring each other and this came out looking at each other mirroring each other okay <sighs> king of swords you may deal with two people that may have overgave or overgiven in a past connection the strength card and is kind of in fear of doing that again like you're in fear of overgiving again or overextending yourself again the hermit could be a Virgo for a lot of you uh somebody's mad at you it's, and i feel heavily like it's the the energy energy that i picked up on it for you was it yesterday day before yesterday i don't know but you ghosted someone or you um you uh, you stopped talking to someone or you kind of changed up on somebody uh gemini's um and you may think it was them but i don't feel like it was them i feel like it was you like you kind of you kind of switched up on somebody um now I'm not saying that that they didn't do anything all right i'm not saying that you did it for no reason i feel like there was definitely a reason why but i feel like you handled it that way because of something that you went through before uh if that makes sense and you're you're like heavy in this energy of not going through what you've been through before and there's nothing wrong with that uh gemini's but just try not to block yourself from from love or block yourself from from a genuine connection or somebody that that genuinely rocks with you uh gemini's so i feel like someone has has kind of um withdrawn or you withdrawn someone here is, is very withdrawn but they really whoever this is really 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 wants to talk and really wants your attention but um they're feeling away. Somebody's feeling away. Even if you are in the right, Gemini's, I feel like this person is, is still feeling away. I'm seeing the King of Pentacles, Nine of Cups, Seven of Cups, Two of Pentacles, and the Knight of Wands. With the Strength card again. Now, usually the Devil in the Strength card is someone that is really, really, really taming themselves. Like somebody really wants to talk, but they are doing everything they can to hold themselves back. <laughs> From saying anything um gemini's and i feel like both of you guys are in this heavily stubborn energy stop flipping all these cards over oh my gosh um so what flipped over is the page of cups the seven of swords the nine of wands the nine of swords and the ten of cups so yeah uh gemini's this energy thank you spirits so we have the eight of cups yeah some of you guys need to kind of leave behind not showing your feelings some of you need to need to get a little bit more vulnerable the moon yeah this is vulnerability here even if you have to get like a therapist or something or whatever but some of you guys need to learn how to be more vulnerable with people you need to tap more into your feminine energy uh gemini's that's that's what i'm getting some of you have closed yourselves off emotionally quite a bit and, and it's because of some things that has happened in the past so this is going to involve heavy 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 self reflection with this hermit card here and oh it does say self reflection here um for you for both of you gemini's for you and whoever's on your mind whoever this person is is that's in your life or coming into your life this involves you really 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 looking at yourself um and where you're going wrong or why you're not getting what you want out of love and relationships because a lot of you are a lot more closed off than you realize you, you need to be open and, and how many times do i tell y'all this thank you spirit the full card how many times do i have to tell y'all this that um you need to get to a place of learning how to be more receptive and more open and receiving it doesn't matter what your gender is okay um, some of you need to learn how to um, open yourselves up to love, open yourselves up to receive love. Um, you may think that's what you're doing, but it's not. Okay, you still have a lot of things that 
uh, you need to work through. And if you are attracting people that have a lot of traumas, then you also have these Geminis. I know it's hard to hear, but it's just what it is. Six of Cups, yep, something from your past. <sighs> Child. And again, it could be both of you. Both of you have these childhood wounds that you need to work with. A lot of you need to consider getting some counseling or something, honey, um, to help you work through these things or, you know, or just do it yourself, you know. Uh, but whatever works for you, Gemini's, I'm seeing Leo, Capricorn, Aquarius, Cancer. <laughs> Whoever this is isn't going to be, uh, they're not going to be gone long. Nine of Swords. Could be another Gemini you're dealing with. Mm, yeah. Uh, the strength card here. Yeah. Somebody may have been like, and I, I feel like it's you. I don't know why, but I feel like it's you. I feel like you have, now you're the runner in a situation. Um, or in your love life in general. Like any little thing that goes wrong in your connections, you're out of there. Like you are not playing any games with anyone. But you have to make sure that is, is it... Is it your boundaries that you are exercising or are you coming from a place of pain and trauma? You have to distinguish the difference between the two. Okay, like figure out what place you're coming from when you are dating and, you know, something's not working out and you just disappear or you just ghost them or whatever the case may be. Okay, now for others of you, this is like a person that you need to deal with something with. So you're either avoiding them um they're avoiding you or you are avoiding them now they're avoiding you so it's like a kind of a, kind of a game that's going back and forth somebody really wants to talk though they will if somebody is wanting to talk to you gemini's and that part resonates with you they are going to talk to you now they may come in a little upset too somebody's mad at you i, I kind of get someone's angry at you for like ghosting them or disappearing on them and you may this and this could be to someone you thought that you weren't going to hear from again as well uh because because you did disappear on someone or you kind of switched up on someone but it wasn't for no reason okay i feel like someone did something that was the last straw and you didn't argue with them you didn't fuss you didn't complain you just removed yourself gemini's and you know like i said you have to distinguish the difference are you coming from uh, a place of exercising your boundaries which is a wonderful thing or are you coming from a place of you are um, coming from a place of hurt and trauma and uh, past letdowns okay and then that's something that needs to be addressed all right I'm just get a couple of these because the message is pretty clear um, Gemini's this is more so holy fucking shit I was going to say this is more so a self-reflection type of thing Okay, I'll get the top two. Um, somebody dealing with an Aquarius. This is Aquarius energy here. Something is yes here. So if, if you're like waiting to hear from somebody or wanting to know if somebody's coming back, they will. Um, Gemini's, something's changing here. Yeah. Something's moving on. There's that Aquarius again. Somebody dealing with an Aquarius here could be a people pleaser because this that's the first word that i thought of this is gemini which is trained this is moving on life journey new endeavor i told you going away one direction on track focus on time keep going forward going with the flow inflexible <laughs> steady climb and no resistance so i feel like gemini this that's you honey um you're you've kind of turned into the runner but just make sure gemini's that you are coming from um a place of you just in asserting your boundaries which is nothing wrong with that or are you coming from a place of trauma okay so this one was the first one that flipped over which i thought was funny uh because i talked about heavy about self stuff because this is a reading of self like you needing to kind of self-reflect um and see and pay attention to the types of energies that you are uh giving out or giving off to people Okay, so this one is mirror, and this is literally mirror, too. 
So someone is mirroring you, Geminis, or this is spirit reiterating that the people that you're attracted to mirror you in some way. So before you call that person a narcissist, which it says narcissistic here, or before you call this, this person is operating from pain and trauma, etc., etc., you need to look at yourself because if you're attracted to someone like that, then you need to kind of be like, okay, if I feel like this person is operating from trauma, pain, etc., 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 then I must be as well. So I need to figure out how and why I am acting the way that I am acting, okay? Or why am I attracting these people to me in the first place? Or why am I attracted to these people? Why am I attracted to people that are non-committal when I want a relationship? You have to ask yourself these things, uh, Gemini. Get you a journal, okay? So we have self-aware, seeing clearly, ego, facing issues, self-assessment, self-improvement, insecure, making comparison, reflection, obsessed, narcissistic, vain, self-love, self-appreciation. Then we have repairman. <laughs> this is Libra. This is repair, fine-tune, heal, fix, many working parts, reset, proceed carefully, needs fixing, make adjustments, recover, skill, make things right, mend, restore, and upgrade it. All right, Gemini's, love that. Hit those likes, hit that subscribe, y'all. Peace out.